Hello, dear friends. This is Yule Humphreys, and I'm glad to be with you today to share with you another word from the Bible on Bible reflections. And I pray that it'll be a word for you that need it, because God's word is a word that is always in time and uh, finds our, uh, our strength and knows where we need it, and it supplies a need in our life, the Word of God. <clears throat> I want to speak to you on the Word uh, found in the book of Romans, the fifth chapter. And it says this, Being justified by faith, we have peace with God through our Lord Jesus Christ. <clears throat> this is a very important word for us, being justified by faith. Now, the word justified is an interesting word. It means that you are completely justified, completely forgiven. Completely not only forgiven, but justified means that it's just as if you had not sinned. If a person goes to court and uh, he has a lawyer that pleads for probation and give a man another chance, and the jury says, all right, we'll do that, we'll put him on probation. Now, he's, he's pardoned to the extent that he's put on probation and he's allowed to go out of the courtroom, a free man. But he's not justified. He's simply pardoned and probated. But when a person goes before a court and a judge, and they find that he's innocent, that he never committed this crime, they all come to the conclusion that he is innocent, and the judge says, I'm sorry that we have accused you of a crime you did not commit. Case is closed you're free to go. That man walks out of the courtroom justified because he did not. He did not commit the sin. Now, we are guilty of sin, but Jesus Christ paid for all our sins, and therefore, when we believe in Him and accept Him as our Lord and our Savior and our God, then all our sins are forgiven forever, and we are justified. And when that happens, we have peace with God. We have peace with God. Being justified by faith in Jesus Christ, we have peace with God. I hope you have peace in your heart with God. See, there is a, a, a barrier between you and me, uh, between you and me and, and God. There's a barrier between us. God is holy and He loves us and He wants to receive us, but sin is a barrier between us. And God hates sin and therefore we're sinners and we're separated from God. But when we come to Christ, and when we believe in Jesus, and ask Him to forgive us and come into our hearts, then we're justified, forgiven. And then we have peace with God. The barrier is taken away, and God receives us, and draws us near to Him, and loves us, and cares for us, and knows what's best, and He will give what's best for you. And so it's a wonderful thing to be justified by faith in Jesus Christ, and then we have peace with God. Let the peace of God rule in your heart. Oh, the peace of God, the peace of God. The peace of God will then keep your hearts and your minds through Christ Jesus. You will not have to worry about anything when you have God's peace, for the peace of God will keep your heart and your mind through Christ Jesus. Praise the Lord. I hope you'll do that, dear friends. I hope you'll believe in Jesus and know the love of God for you. There's a little story I, I've heard years ago about the little girl putting a puzzle together. The puzzle was a Christian puzzle, and it had the picture of Jesus in the middle of it. His, his face was in the middle, and then all around was the hills and the sheep. And the little girl put it together, and it's remarkably... Uh, quick, it wasn't too long. She had that whole puzzle put together. And her father walked in and said, Well, honey, that's wonderful that you put this together so fast. And she said, Daddy, I learned something. That when you get the picture of Jesus, when you get him together, then all the other pieces fit in real easy. And that's a good lesson for us in life. When we get Jesus in the center of our lives, when we get him in the right place, all the other pieces of our lives will fit together and work together and we'll be able to see the answer and find the way and walk with God. May the Lord bless you and may you find peace with God because you're justified through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen.